time for the late edition of the Angel of the Day. I'm Alicia and I'm here to bring you Angel number two, Yeloya. Angel number two can be found in all the other angels, which are the 72 names of God, on AliciaBaza.com. So check it out. Go over to AliciaBaza.com and you'll see all the stuff. You'll see the angels on there. So let's check out angel number two. Hi, Linda. Yeloya. Okay, I'll have to turn this baby around. Okay. Hey, Holly. Just in time for the angels tonight. Okay, so today's angel is angel number two. Hi, Carmela. Welcome. So this, this is a set of angels that I have been working on since June. These are the 72 names of God. These are blessed angels. Beautiful. We have a little bit of happy birthday, Colleen Farrell. I love you. These angels are uh, blessed angels from the Bible. And we have a little bit of the New Testament and the Old Testament going on. So the first card is for the angel whose guardian angel is. Um, hello, Marianne. So this is the guardian angel of those born between March 26th and 30th. This is a seraphim, the angel of love and wisdom. You are not a patient person. You love to do everything yourself. You can get done, it done fast and easy. Seeing others stuck makes you crazy. All of your life you have relied on your own intuition. In spite of your impatience, you are a very friendly and amicable person. You are super curious about your destiny and do what you can to investigate it. You easily see the lessons in your hardships. This makes you wiser and stronger. So below that, you've got Yeshua, which is Jesus in the Jewish Ichthus, which is his fish sign. And then after that, you've got a little bit of the Old Testament, Psalms 2220, which says, Deliver me from the sword, my precious life from the power of the dogs. So this is the other side, Yeloya. Yeloya rules over the following days. January 3rd, March 21st, June 1st, August 12th. That's why this is today's angel and October 23rd. So this, Colleen, is your ruling angel, Yeloya. Meditation on the name of God, Yeloya, will help you to restore love in your life. He will help you find your soulmate. God tasks Yeloya with bringing love. He helps you with relationship problems. He restores love and passion into your marriage or other relationship, encouraging faithfulness and respect. He helps us when we are in difficult situations. This sounds just like you, Colleen. <laughs> he helps us if we have been attacked or hurt unjustly. Yeloya shows us how to restore and keep harmony in our relationships. He teaches us how to create inner peace and calmness. Yeloya literally means the helping God. And this is one of the things I love about these angels is um, it describes the person whose birthday ru or ruling day it covers. And it's so neat because I always know, like Colleen, Franca. all right, it says you're not a patient person. That's true, Colleen. Come on. <laughs> and you like doing things yourself, right? <laughs> um, and you are very friendly. You can, look, this is, your, this is your ruling angel here. Let's just look at it again. You're curious, okay? <laughs> Hey, Robert. So anyway, I always find great, it's really great fun listen, watching these angels and listening to them and seeing what they bring. Um, and so as far as like the person that they're describing, it usually does relate, not always 100%, but this is your ruling angel, not your guardian angel. So um, sometimes the ruling angel does, you know, pertain to the person more than the guardian angel does, but it all depends. So anyway. For more information on this angel and on my, um, it's to say I'm not a patient person though. It says I'm not a patient. You, you, you can be sometimes. Sometimes you're not patient <laughs> when you come here. <laughs> anyway, anyhow, um, it doesn't make or break who you are exactly. So anyway, for check out this angel and other angels on my website, also my, my group meditations, my CD, my book coming up, Satya. Check all that out on AliciaBaz.com. And I'll see you tomorrow for tomorrow's guardian angel, angel number three, which is Seyote. Seyote. So check it out, and I'll see you tomorrow. I hope you had a great day, Colleen. Love you. Bye.